talking about connecting students to colleges through free SAT prep. Our team here consists of uh, five UT computer science majors. We've been working on uploading content, getting the account registration set up, and working on the practice system. Our story at Prepify starts with Elsie. Elsie was a student at Washington High School, and he wasn't planning on going to college. Uh, this is because his family couldn't afford the high tuition rates that many of us face. Um, luckily for LC, though, uh, our founding Prepify team sat down with him for an hour a day via Skype and went through SAT prep uh, materials. Because of that, he was able to score competitively, competitively on the SAT and receive a full ride scholarship to Ohio Wesleyan. Unfortunately, LC is not the only one out there like this. Many students struggle um, to get into college because of their financial situation. Now, whenever we look at SAT uh, data with respect to family income, this test has become heavily criticized uh, to the extent that it's been nicknamed the student affluence test. The number one indicator for how a student will perform on the SAT is actually what their family income is. Now, whenever we look at the current population in colleges, 74% of students come from the top quartile income bracket, while a mere 3% come from the bottom quartile. This skewed representation stems heavily from the fact that uh, many um, students, even if they score well on SAT, feel that uh, they can't afford these colleges. However, colleges are actually spending money trying to reach these students. Um, private universities spend about $2,400 per student per year trying to reach these diamonds in a rough, while uh, public universities spend closer to $500 per student. Um, both private and public spend around $9 million in, um, for their recruiting budget trying to reach these students. Um, even with that high uh, budget, there's still not uh, the representation of bottom income. Uh, bottom bracket income level students is still very low. Now imagine if we had a tool that could help these students improve their scores while also helping them reach these colleges that obviously want them. That's where Prepify comes in. We're a web-based application for SAT preparation. Uh, we have uh, content from bell curves and we plan to make the lessons and practice exams uh, highly engaging. Uh, using the KEEP model, students can work towards tangible uh, goals uh, where they can get uh, prizes from corporate sponsors such as Walmart. Um, they would receive a start, like a Walmart or Starbucks gift card for reaching certain goals that these companies can uh, sponsor. Most importantly though, we offer these introductions to colleges. Here's what the typical student dashboard would look like. They can see how far they are to reaching their goal, uh, continue where they were, uh, where they left off, or they continue they can choose to work at a different section. This is what one of the practice questions will look like. They can go back and forth between each question and see the reading prompt. And at the end of an exam, they can see which ones they got right, which ones they got wrong, and what the correct answer would be. Now on April 5th, we rolled out our minimal viable product uh, to some schools around Austin, like Lanier, and got some usability and testing feedback. We hope by June to have pilot testing with the schools around the area, uh, work in Facebook integration, have badges for certain goals, and offer more lessons for certain areas. Now by no November, we hope to have it open to the public and have the commercial rewards like the gift cards um, out as well. Throughout this time, we'll be working with colleges to form relationships so that by 2016, we can have colleges on board and looking at their own university interface trying to find these students. Now when we look at what's out there right now, currently there's an SAT prep book, Kaplan class, and Khan Academy. Um, Kaplan classes are pretty expensive. They can cost upwards to $1,000. Um, SAT prep books, while less expensive, aren't very engaging for students. Khan Academy uh, is free and it's gamified, but it lacks the one thing that Prepify holds. And that's these uh, facilitating the introductions to colleges. Now, um, SAT is going, or, sorry, Prepify is going to offer their services to colleges um, as a subscription. Based, uh, we're going to use a tiered, tiered 